Welcome to NHL 22. Today we are going to learn how to do the spinorama as well as some other tricks involving half spin, partial spin, and all kinds of ways to set up goals and move the offense around and get the defenders off so we can improve our puck possession. So let's go ahead and get started with the spinorama. One thing I've learned about this move is the player's energy needs to be charged. So you can probably only do it like once until the player uh, recharges their batteries. The spin move is basically L2, pressing it down. Now if you notice our player skating, uh, we're not going to be able to do it there. So we want to get our player to where he's not skating, right there. He's kind of coasting. We're going to press L2 right here. He's going to spin around. And now we've got the defender kind of out of position. So we're going to cut to the right. And he's going to block Connor McDavid and give us just enough space to sneak in there and go a five-hole backhand for a nice goal. Here, instead of going for a full spin, we're going to do a half spin. The idea is to try to set up a one-timer and make it easier to pass. So we're going to tap L2 or the left trigger for the Xbox. And we get the half spin in. We're going to press the right trigger or R2 for the PS4. To get to the open shooter and then flick the right analog stick up for a nice one timer right there. Here we're going to use a half spin to change directions on the defender. We've got a left handed shooter, we want to go skate across to the left. The defender's not giving that to us, so we're going to skate to about the red circle and then tap L2. Okay, the defender bites. We're going to cut inside with a left analog stick, so we're going to push to the left, get by the defender there, and we're able to skate across with enough space and then flick the right analog stick up while using the left analog stick to aim for the top right corner and get a nice cool right there. The left analog stick can also be effective in making spin moves. Here we want puck control and we want to draw in number 71 to chase after us. He's going after us. Okay, he's at where we got our back turned. He is on our left side. That's the right side of the screen. And what we're going to do is we're going to skate a little bit. And then we are going to roll our left analog stick to the left. And then push it forward. And then right when we get separation, we're going to push in L3, the left analog stick. Going to push it in like a button. And then we're going to accelerate here. And we've lost that defender. Now we're going to skate back to normal here. And we're going to try another spin move. This time we're just simply going to roll the left analog stick around in a circular fashion and then skate the other way, number 55, over skates, and we're able to flick the right analog stick up for a wrist shot and we get a nice goal right there. And of course, if one is having a little bit of trouble getting the moves down, it's always good to go into practice mode and try some things out. In this example right here, we're basically going to skate in and we're going to hold L2 right before we get to the goal and then get the goalie out of position and then fire a wrist shot there. And of course, that is going to wrap this up. As always, if one is looking for more tips on NHL 22, there is a playlist on this channel. And of course, to make it easier to find, uh, what I'll do is I will put a link in the description as well as a link in the comment section. Thanks for watching, and of course, good luck.